Okay, so now let's dive into some solos here. We've already had the intro solo in a previous lesson. So this is going to be solos number two and three that we're going to be working on here. So this first one's going to start and sounding kind of like this. I'm sorry. Alright, so let's take a look at that one. So we're going to start with a unison bend here. It's going to be your first finger at the ninth fret on the uh, first string and then your third finger at the twelfth fret on the uh, second string. And when you pick those two strings, you're going to bend the, whole, the, the third finger up a whole step till that note on the second string matches the note on the first. And you're going to do that twice. It, after you do it, always kind of pick the first string a couple times after it. So you do the bend, kind of gives it this some more edge. And then we have, so, now after you've done that, you should be at the full bend here, the second bend, you're going to pick that and release. And when you do that bend, see that I did it and I released down and then I picked three times and then come over and pick nine I mean I'm sorry the eleventh fret on the third string and then you got to pick nine and eleven together the, the nine being on the third and that um, uh, nine being on the second string and you're gonna do another unison bend here when you're on these two strings that you only have to be two frets apart to do that not the big three so and when you get to the top of that bend you can put some vibrato on that all right, so all together. And then we have this little one. This is pretty easy. Slide to the 11 on the fourth string, and then nine on the third. Then slide 11 to 13 with your third finger on the third string. Then come over to the 12 on the second string and 14. So we get this. Now when you get that to that 14, you're going to do it a bend. Then you're going to pick the bend when it's already up at the top of the bend. Release, come back to 12, and then do the bend again on the 14. So we have, I'm going to go real slow here. Alright, then we're going to stay at the 14th fret, but instead of bending it just a whole step this time, we're going to bend it a step and a half. So we're going to try to make this sound like the 17th fret. And this part, you're going to have to really use your ear here. We have, you're going to do the bend of the 17th fret, and then you're going to release the bend just a half step. So the note's going to come back down to where it would just be a whole step and then back up to the half step. Let me just demonstrate. See that? I kind of lowered it back down to where the bend was only a whole step bend and then I raised it back up to the half step. Okay, and then you get to pick that full bend a couple of times when it's bent up after you get there again. Then we're going to go 12 and 14. Then come back to the 12 and do a bit whole set bend there. And then pick it flat. So we got this. You didn't see, you didn't hear me come back down. It just went. When you get that top of that bend, you, you let off pressure or kill it with your, your pick down here. And then. So all together, that goes. Some nice little bending lines there. Then we have this last lick in this uh, 
this uh, first solo we're doing in this video. So let's take a look at that. We start at the ninth fret with your first finger, the third string. Then a whole step bend at the 11, then nine on the second and nine on the first. That kind of standard Chuck Berry lick there. Now when we get to this part, we start speeding up just a little bit. We do a half step bend, a little, just a, a, a slight bend on the 12th fret on the second string with the third string. Come back to that nine on the first string. So, so far we got this. Then 12 and nine. 12, 2, 9 on the, the uh, second string. Then back to that bend at the 11 and 9 and 9 again on the second and first. Then come back down 12, then 9 on the uh, second string. Then 12, 11, 9 on the third and then 11 on the fourth string then come back over to the 11 on the third string and do a quick slide up to the 13th fret just like that and then come down to the nine and this is the last note but after this note we're gonna you just kind of gotta just throw it up the string throw it you know just slide up and down the string let me play through that last section again. All right. Okay, now let's take a look at, we're, we're at well, first of all, after this solo, which was the second solo, it goes back to the verse section again, which we've already talked about. Then we go back into sol the, doing another solo. So basically, just after every verse, he's going into a solo. So um, we're going to start this third solo here, and it's going to sound like this. go through that. We're going to start here at the ninth fret with your third finger. So it's like one, one, two, one, one, two, that little rhythm there. Just, just right there on the, the third um, string, ninth fret. Then after you've done that little rhythm twice on it, you're going to pick it again, slide it to 11, then pick 11 and slide it to 13 and then play 11 on the 4th string. So get this. All together. Then we come back to some unison bends again, but this time instead of hitting, we're going to just do the bend on the, the 2nd string first at the 12th fret. And then pick the ninth twice after you've done the bend on this string. And then the second time doing the bend, you're actually going to bend them, bo uh, hit both strings together, and then pick the nine twice there too. While that's still doing, so let me do it this together. This by itself, then pick nine, then together. Now we still now we do that like we did before. Pick that twelve, release it, then grab nine. And then come over to the third string and do three bends at the 11th fret. Three whole step bends. All right, so. All right, so after we got this full bend, this last full bend going, we're gonna pick it and release. Then nine, 
then 11 on the fourth string. Okay, and then we're gonna go back up, nine, 11, when you get to 11, do a full step bend. So we get this. Then to the nine and on the first and se the second and first string. So you see what we're doing there, that same lick. Then let's start moving up. We're gonna get, take the, the 12th fret here with your first finger and, I mean, sorry, your third finger at the, on the second string. Slide it to 14, then 12, then 14. So all together we had it. Okay, so so we got this 14. Then you can do a bend. Then you can pick it again and release it and go to 12. So this is going to be liquid. We're going to do this. Alright, so after you get that 12 and 14 there, do the bend, bend and release. You're going to pick it and release the bend. 12. Back to 14. Do the whole step bend, but hold it there. Don't bring it back down. Just kill it, and then come back to come back to 12, and have that bend pretty much almost there before you hear the note. And then bring pick that flat. So get this. Then come over to the the uh, 14 on the second string, and then 12 on the first string, and then we're gonna do the bends at the 14th fret, whole step bends on the second string. Now you see that some of those are pre bends. I so I'm doing a bend up, bend up, pick it flat. Then a pre bend, and then down, then pre bend, and release that pre bend, and then slide from 11 to 13 to end the solo. Okay. Now we're on our way to the slide guitar solo and the, uh, the big solo towards the end, all right? So stay tuned for that section. It's coming up next. <laughs> 